The roots of the National Institute of Education goes all the way back to 1950. The establishment of the Teachers' Training College was to signify the importance of education and it was also a way of formalising teacher education for Singapore. The TTC moved from the Cane Hill site to the Patterson Road campus and it was also there that the Institute of Education, or the IE, was established. My teacher preparation was done at Patterson Road, the Teachers' Training College. We moved to the Bukit Timah campus in 1983 and it was also then that he established the National Institute of Education. It's one of the most beautiful campuses. Next to Botanic Gardens, so it's a very natural and nice setting. It was full of fun and laughter. We had so much joy working there. That was where I met many fellow young people like myself then who were also passionate and they were all training to be teachers. Dr. Ruth Wong was the founding director of the Institute of Education. We needed quality teachers. So Dr. Ruth Wong was engaged as the first director. She brought um, a lot of rigour into teacher education curricula, important education research, and also introduced the multidisciplinary approach. And she has this vision that in Singapore, every Singapore child really fulfilling their potential and having really a good education. And I can say that many of the things that I did was an extension of her vision and her values. Teachers are important and they deserve a purpose-built institution. I was very hopeful that it will become a full-fledged school of learning for NTU, but also engage the teachers in high-level research. The Bukit Timah campus it was a good starting point. But as you know, it's a small campus and uh, if you are going to increase the number of students and staff. Pukatima was too small for the growth of NIE. We expected this place to be spectacular. When we came here, it was even more impressive. We were able to build state-of-the-art facilities. State-of-the-art laboratories for both content teaching as well as for pedagogy. There were purpose-built laboratories specific to each sub-discipline of education. The reason was to be on Jurong campus so that they could have interactions better with the other faculties, departments and things like that. When I survey your vast quadrangles, ringed round by never-ending corridors that circumambulate the tree of knowledge, that shall guide the brave new teachers of tomorrow, in NIE, we have one of the largest education libraries in the region. It is an important part of our work because it symbolises the value that we place on knowledge and learning. The flexibility that our professors and our lecturers give, that also taught us that, that we need to be providing that space for our own students to be able to fail and to be able to learn from it. It will be impossible to quantify all the contributions of the past NIE directors. They have left behind a very strong legacy for us to build on. About two years ago, we planted a tambusu tree and it was to commemorate the life and the contributions of our late NIE director, Professor Lee Seng Kong. Our teachers form the central pillar of our education system. The quality of any education system, its output and outcomes depends very much on the quality of teachers. This is a maxim which is also integral to NIE's role as the flagship of teacher education in Singapore. NIE has come a long way. We are no longer a teaching college. We have a very important role to play uh, in carrying out education research as well as in continually uh, innovating the way we teach. They went overseas and made a name for itself over the years. That, I think, is a very good development. So as NIE Director, I feel very honoured to be at the forefront of this noble cause for the country.